With Coel. She is young, pedigreed, oozes confidence, and is on the eve of her much talked about debut with Salman Khan. Sunakshi Sinha, the sassiest star kid on the Bollywood block, is right here on my couch to talk about how it feels to have everything going for you and what's on stake. Sunakshi Sinha, thank you very much for coming on the couch with me today. Thank you for having me on your couch today. Oh. <laughs> Now, you're on the eve of your big fat debut. What are your emotions? It's, um, Can't really say it's. I'm feeling a lot of mixed emotions right now. I'm feeling happy. I'm feeling scared. I'm nervous. I'm excited, but um, overall, it's a happy feeling. I'm really looking forward to it. I mean, all the hard work finally gets, you know, some credit and pays off. So, I'm really looking forward to it. But did you always want to do this? Because no, I, I did not. You know me. You've yeah, seen me. Yeah, and I remember you saying, "I'm never going to be an actress. I'm going to, you know, do, be a fashion designer. I'm going to be a model." <laughs> yeah, but. Um, I even I don't know how it's happened, and I still don't believe that it's happened. But um, yeah, I was studying fashion designing, and then um, right after I finished college, I lost the weight, and I said, "Oh, the glamour bug had bitten me by then." So I said, "Let's try modeling." Before or after you lost the weight? Uh, while I was losing the weight. <laughs> what What is the trigger to lose the weight? Because you um, were always confident. I mean, the, for the people who don't know her, then she was she was what? Like how much how much uh, plumper would you say you were? Uh, 30 kilos. Okay, so she was 32 kilos plump because she's so tall. It didn't really show. And, it and showed. <laughs> it didn't show that much, but you were so super, super uber confident. Yeah. Right? That was. I don't know what. I think I was like demented here. Was, the ego was also huge, and now as I've shrunk, my ego shrunk. But um, what a pity! I yeah, like the sad. I like the big fat thing. ego that you are. I was are. so cool then. <laughs> She used to take a camera and take her own pictures. Yeah, I take my own pictures like that, and pose and give those looks and all that. So glamour was always in you. Yeah, probably. I think um, yeah, it comes now having such a beautiful mother, and uh, people are always like, oh my god, your mother's so beautiful. You look just like her, and you know, it kind of gets to you. <laughs> so I think that's what was uh, in my head, but. Um, Yeah, the ego has shrunk, and I don't do that anymore. <laughs> so, how did this film actually end up happening? So, mm. you walked the ramp. We saw you walking the ramp. And yeah, um, I lost the weight, and actually, uh, Salman was the one who egged me on to uh, lose the weight. I don't know. He saw it in me at that time. He said, when the, the first few times I met him, he said that there's nothing you can do except for act. So I was like, thank you very much. Uh, that doesn't make me feel too good about the things I'm already doing. <laughs> so, I think uh, that was the trigger. And I did end up losing the weight, and he kept his promise. And he said, "Okay, you're doing a film with me now, so you can't really say no to him." So why would you? Why would I? No, because he came with the perfect package. I mean, the script, the director. But is it producer. intimidating to work with him? Because a, he's been a family friend. Yeah. B, he's much older, and C, he's a super superstar. Um, so. a superstar I can handle. I've seen that with my father. <laughs> so and, and me, myself, and I. No, 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 not yet. <laughs> But. Uh, That uh, I could handle. Plus, we. I think uh, him being a family friend has been uh, an asset because uh, I've known him for that much longer. And uh, but did you really call him uncle in the old no, days? No, are you mad? Yeah. Is, is, Who will call Salman Khan uncle? No way. He'll probably punch you, right? Yeah, like he'll punch me, he'll bury me, and like I'll never. So what do you call him? I call him Salman. And is it okay because you do have a huge age difference? Yeah, it's fine. I think um, he's got a lot of friends that are. Much younger, and I'm sure none of them call him, uh, you know, Uncle Obai. Please come on. But were you apprehensive of playing? You're 23. Yeah. Here's your debut, and you're working with like a 40 plus um, actor. Was there a, and opposite him? It's not like you're playing a younger, older. Yeah, but not at all. Not at all. Actually, I mean, look at him. Yeah. <laughs> that's the mustache, not there. That's, and that's the mustache. That's a uh, yeah. Yeah, I think the mustache, uh, the look for his uh, the the dabang look. <laughs> I think I'm going to take credit for that because uh, he was hesitant to put on a mustache. He was like, "Both gum lagana padta hai, chipka na padta hai. You can't smile, you can't laugh." So I was like, "Just put it on, try it on." He tried on, he made that face, and I'm like, "It looks good." Said, yeah, he said, "Yeah," and that's it. He's trusting you. Yeah, right? imagine. 